Sometimes you just gotta punch fear in the face. And no pun intended, we're going to dive deep with this one. Hi, my name is Rod Kresge and welcome back to another Monday Meditation with Youth Apostles. Today's gospel is Jesus walking on water from Matthew chapter 14, verses 22 to 36. Okay, I'm about to read the part in the gospel that we're focused on, Jesus walking on water. Meanwhile, the boat already a few miles offshore was being tossed about by the waves for the wind was against it. Jesus came toward them walking on the sea. When the disciples saw him walking on the sea, they were terrified. It is a ghost, they said, and they cried out in fear. This isn't just a reaction in the sense of like, oh, it must be a ghost, but think about this. It wasn't like a calm water that Jesus was walking on. It was very windy, waves were coming, and the people who were terrified, especially Peter, he was a fisherman. He was used to rough waters. He was used to rough things. He was used to punching fear in the face. But at this time, he was very afraid. So you know these waves are really going. At once, Jesus spoke to them, Take courage, it is I. Do not be afraid. The main point I want to make with this reading is that when we are afraid, we see things differently. So they saw Jesus walking towards them on water. Now when he's walking towards them and the elements like the waves are hitting Jesus and Jesus is not being phased by the natural elements, Instead of them going, whoa, this is Jesus, he is a man and even so much more, they made him less. They said, that can't be Jesus. That must be an illusion. That must be a ghost. It's usually hard to believe that Jesus is above that. Not in the sense above it, like he's uninvolved. He's very much involved because he cares about you so much. He's willing to come through the water and come meet you where you're at and love you too much to leave you there. So he told Peter, come. Come to me. When Jesus says, take courage, it is I, do not be afraid. He's not ignoring fear. He's just letting us know who we should be looking towards. He's letting us know to take off the glasses of fear and put on the glasses of faith. I'll be doing the rest of the Monday meditations in August and hope that you will be able to join me then. And also I will do a bigger version of the Monday meditations on my channel, Big Rod K, and that link is in the description below. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already. And if you already are a subscriber to Youth Apostles Institute, thank you very much. Thank you for joining me and Youth Apostles and see you next week. God bless.